area introduction of figure area of rectangle and square dear students in standard 5th you have learned to find out the area of a rectangle and square with the help of a graph let us revise it dear student to identify it we have a graph paper method a graph paper consists of squares of measure 1 cm by 1 cm put this graph paper on the figure and make an outline of the figure now look at the squares enclosed by the figure you can see some of them are completely enclosed some half some more than half and some less than half consider full square as one square unit and count it 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 the full square are 7 the square more than half also consider as one square unit count it as 1 2 3 4 5 6 the more than half squares are 6 now take half square as half square unit these are 1 2 3 4 4 half square we can write it as 4 into 1 by 2 that is equal to 2 full square and lastly ignore less than half square now count total square that is 7 plus 6 plus 2 is equal to 15 square unit here square are of major 1 cm by 1 cm Therefore instead of unit we use centimeter therefore the area of figure is 15 square centimeter Wow ma'am you make it very easy with graph paper Now I can identify which one figure has more area by counting and comparing squares of second figure Now to find a area of rectangle We can take a help of graph paper. Take a graph paper. Make a rectangle of length 5 cm and breadth 3 cm. Count the squares. It will be 15 full squares covered by rectangle. Therefore ma'am, the area of rectangle is equal to 50 square cm and it can be also written as 5 into 3 square centimeter that is length into breadth very good good answer my dear therefore area of rectangle is equal to length into breadth now tell me as you know all sides of square are of the same length what will be the area of square ma'am as compared to rectangle square has all sides of same length therefore the area of square is equal to side into side that is side square wow my dear students now i think all you get what the basic ideas of mensuration are Now let us study some more of close figure. We know side as a boundary of a shape and its area is the region covered by sides. A closed figure has three parts. First, the edge or boundary of the figure. Second, the interior of the figure. Third, the exterior of the figure. The part consisting of the boundary of the figure and its interior is called as the area of figure now let us learn about the area of other closed figures like square rectangle we have learned how to find area of a square and rectangle in the earlier class 
area of square is equal to side into side area of rectangle is equal to length into breadth the length and the breadth of a rectangular piece of a land are 500 meter and 300 meter respectively find its area the area of piece of a land will be its length into its breadth that is 500 into 300 is equal to 150000 square meter the length of one side of this square shaped garden is 35 meter find its area as we know area of a square will be side into side and hence area of square garden will be 35 into 35 we get the area of a garden is 1225 square meter the wall of dimension is 10 meter into 10 meter find the total labor charges for painting the wall if the labor charges for painting 1 meter square of the wall is rupees 2.50 per square meter. Solution Painting of the wall has to be done. Now wall is in square shape, hence total area of the wall is side into side. The area of wall is 100 meter square. We need the area of a wall that is equal to 100 meter square. Total labor charges for painting the wall is rupees 2.50 into 100 is equal to rupees 250. Summary In this lesson, we have learned interior and exterior of a figure. Area of square is side into side. Area of rectangle is length into breadth. So, that is all about this lesson, students. Learning is a fun, so keep learning.